Hey y'all, it's Christian Beauty 101. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a Amazon haul. I did get three palettes that came in. Um, super excited to swatch them. I haven't opened them yet. Um, so I don't know if you know they're broken yet or not, or if they're in good shape. Um, but I did want to pick them up and purchase them because they were, um, you know, a collector. There was only three palettes of that brand, so I'm super hyped about that. Um, if you are new to my channel, um, hey, how are you all doing? Um, if you guys are not a member of my channel, make sure you like, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up for me. And I want to thank every single one of you who's participating in the giveaway at the end of this month. Um, I'm writing all your names and putting them in this cup right here that I did purchase from the Dollar Tree um, a few hauls back. Um, but yeah, if you guys, there is still time to, you know, apply for the giveaway. Um, all you need to do is comment down below your favorite movie, your favorite color, and your favorite holiday. Um, and I will write your name down on a piece of paper and I will draw it at the end of this month. Um, I'm also going to swatch these palettes because I'm super excited. Um, I looked into the comments and they had five out of five um, stars. So I'm kind of hoping that, you know, they're as good as people are saying they are through the comments on Amazon. But we're going to sit here and open them up together and go through there and everything like that. So it's going to probably be a little long video. Get yourself a drink, roll you up something, you know, smoke, do a little smoke smoke, you know, sippy sip. I'm actually drinking Sprite with an orange and a little bit of coconut rum. Which a little bit is like a shot and a half and stuff of rum in it and some soda and just a splash of orange. So, yeah, we are going to jump on in. I will show you guys the palettes and then I'm going to pause the video and um, open up the palettes. So, they're not, you know, taking so long for me to open because sometimes I do struggle. But yes, so the first one is Touching Up and they're from Beauty Glazed. All three of them is from Beauty Glazed. This is all um, one, um, how do you describe it? One set, I guess you can say. There was only three palettes um, with this type of theme going on with Beauty Glazed. And I just got it because I love all the packagings and everything in there are just so beautiful. But the first one is Touching Up. And as you can see, you can't really see with the glare, but I'll show you again before I, when I swatch them. But it got a deer with antlers. It's just very beautiful. And then on the back, they do show the names. There are 25 um, shades in each palette. So I'm really happy about that. This one they wrapped up, so I have to open it just to get it out. I don't know why they didn't wrap the other ones, but that's okay. Maybe it was just a protector because it was the one in the middle. So, and each one of these palettes um, were $10. They were nine something. I want to say nine ninety eight, but all together for all the palettes. Plus free shipping over twenty five, um, it was like thirty two dollars. So that wasn't bad for all three of these. And then this one is tasting up. I just love the designs right here. Like I think deers are so beautiful and stuff, especially with the antlers and stuff. They're just so gorgeous. And then this one is called Dreaming Up. And this is, the picture on this one is like, um, I want to say it's a bull, maybe. Because it doesn't really look like a deer. It might be a deer, but it doesn't look like a deer. 
but um same thing all the names are on the back um this one is palette c this one is palette b and this one is palette a but i'm gonna pause here and i'm gonna open them up and then i'm gonna show you what the goodies look like inside um and we'll go from there okay so just one second y'all okay y'all i'm back um i did put a little lippy on my lips were getting dry and it's um from wet and wild rose gold which is super pretty um i was super busy today outside we've been doing a whole bunch of yard work and stuff and everything like that so i wasn't gonna put no makeup on it was like 82 outside today very pretty okay so we're gonna swatch the touching up and this is what it looks like without the wrapper so gorgeous like and then the side is a bright purple so pretty here's the back and it's just so pretty there is no mirror it does come with this crappy thing i usually take them out um that's the shades and this is um number a very pretty they got the names um you see like a little flyaways in it i guess from you know coming out here it only took two days because i ordered it friday um but other than that it looks in really really good shape i mean they just had it and that fucking envelope thing with like really no support so i was kind of expecting it to be really bad but actually it's not too bad and stuff you can kind of see where some of the little flyaways are in here like right here but none of them's broken so that's okay with me okay so we're gonna go from left to right <clears throat> the first one is called pearl butter sandstone amber and bronze so i'm gonna do the pearl butter sandstone sandstone and amber first these are very very smooth there might be um another part to this video because it might be long but i'm gonna try to move it along to where it's not so long but who knows we're just sitting here hanging out so these are them colors this yellow is beautiful these are very pretty that would be gorgeous as a highlight or at like the crease of your eyes that would also be gorgeous like in your tear zone that'd be really pretty there okay so the next four is going to be bronze um ginger sunshine and apricot which sounds very delightful so bronze ginger these are very very um silky it says chalk but they are very silky Ooh, that glitter you guys that pressed glitter is to die for like you guys see that this one right here oh so pretty they only have two of them in this palette but that's okay. Shades are very pretty. Oh, that glitter is gorgeous. They do got good pigment. And I can't complain because they were $10. I had palettes that I purchased that was like, you know, $15, $18. And... The pigments weren't really great at all but i am very impressed with the color so far and that glitter does leave a whole bunch of glitter on your arm but that's all right because that's usually how glitter is but that's all right 
and that's cool okay so the next four is going to be rust gray blush and rosewood which the blush is a very weird weird color for it because it's this one right here so rust gray blush rosewood like I said these colors are very very pretty like I'm really digging these oh that color is gorgeous oh that green's so pretty look my hands are still a little wet but y'all can y'all can see it So how is everyone's week going? My week's going pretty good. Just been super, super busy doing some yard work. Um, yesterday, me and my fiance planted, um, you know, our, my stepmom's rose garden because we got a few flowers for Easter. You know, we did it on the down low so she didn't know, but we did that all yesterday and it looks very pretty. She loved it. Um, the next four colors will be red wine, ocean sky, and blue baby. Blue baby. But yeah, my weekend was great. My Easter was great. You know, hanging around with the family and doing a few things around the house as well and everything because we're trying to get everything up and going that color is so pretty now the greens in here you all are very very impressive same with the blues because the blue mats and the greens like these two right here are gorgeous them two shades are kind of hard to work with and stuff to make colors with same with the yellows and um you know even the whites like some whites and makeup palettes aren't really the best but that's okay okay so the next four is navy a zero zero i think that's how you say that i don't know peacock and demon so let's get into them like I said, these are super, super creamy. I can't wait to work with these colors because I have so many colors to choose from. Like, yes. Okay, I kind of got a little blue right here, so I need to wipe it off. <laughs> but that's these colors. The dark colors are really, really dark as well. very pretty colors i'm really enjoying this palette okay so we got five left in this one and we're only at 14 so i'm gonna try to do both of them if not you'll see a part two okay y'all if not i'll sit there and pause it and then i'll record again and i'll combine these two videos together um, okay, so we're on Pearl, Pickle, Emerald, and Seaweed. And the Pearl is another pressed glitter, but these are very, very creamy and gorgeous. Like, this Pearl is so pretty, y'all. Like, I'm digging the Pearl and the Sunshine one that I swatched earlier very very pretty like look at the pearl that one's gorgeous it's another pressed glitter 
Very pretty. Like, look at that. Yeah, so pretty, y'all. A lot of rubbing to do. Mm -hmm. To get all this stuff off. That glitter was a little hard to come off. It like matted down in place. You see that? Okay, so the last color is called dark. What's that color right there? Again, this is from Beauty Glazed, Touching Up, and this is Palette A. Very, very pretty. Love that. That one is gorgeous. Like I said, I have a, um, a few more orders coming in that you guys will definitely see. Um, but yes, I do have more orders coming in. Because I told y'all this girl spoiled herself because who cares? You live once. Mine's will live it up a little. Okay, so the next one is um, Tasting Up, and this is Palette B. Now, this one has three pressed glitters in it. As y'all can see from Palette A and Palette B, they are different colors. <clears throat> so the first one is white, the second one is gold, and the third one lemon. The fourth is gold sand. So they're the ones we are swatching first. Um, actually, no, to be honest, I think I'm going to do the glitters last. So I'm going to go do the mattes and the shimmers first. So we're not going to do the gold where I'm going to do the orange instead. Which these are so pretty. They did a good job on the yellows in this packet be great with um, eye primer and like I said if you guys are you know on a budget and you ain't got much money to mess with or if you're a beginner um, these will work amazing for yourself um, for a family member for your you know daughter your niece um, so on the next four is Barbie pink and plum and lilac I'm trying to make this video a little faster which I know I'm gonna have to pause it because I'm already up at to 19 minutes and I ain't gonna have this palette done in about 35 minutes same with the last one I ain't gonna have that done in 35 minutes Okay, so these are all these colors. Very pretty. So all these four are very, very light colors, but if you have a great eye primer, like me, I don't really use primer. I usually use um, concealer and stuff on my eye. Or, um, where is it? Or I use this um, highlighter from LA Colors from Shop Miss A. Usually put this on my eye to give my eye that white base look. And it works very good. Um, we're going to do Mint Grass, Seaweed, 
sage and ocean. I love how this one has, you know, the ocean theme and the fruit theme. That is so very, very cute. This palette, this one, you have to um, really dig into the colors to get them going. But I think after I work with them with a little bit and um, loosen them up from using them, like they're all pretty, this one and this one's gorgeous. Like using them, you know, breaking them in some after getting the first little layer off I think they will be perfectly fine yep I'm gonna definitely have to do another one because this one's at 20 minutes and I'm almost done with this one almost so the next one is orchard um, moss jungle and basil That orchis is a very pretty purple. Very pretty. Very pretty. That olive green is gorgeous. Okay, so the next four is um, Juniper Green Coffee and Cinnamon. I think that's how you say that. I don't know. It is what it is. And this green is like not really a green. It doesn't look green, but... It's a very pretty color. Okay. I mean, that's the green right there. That's like a deep, deep, like ocean green. Just a plain nude right there. And these two greens are very pretty. My swatches suck and you know, Fingers still being a little damp and my hands still being a little damp. Because I ain't got time for it to dry. I got another whole palette to do. Okay, so the last two mats is called Walnut and Dark. And then I'll move on to the three last glitters. So Walnut and Dark. Like some of the matte ones, some of them are silky and some of the other ones are um, like a dryish powder. But overall, this palette is very pretty. Two different types of browns. I'm really digging these palettes so far. They are very nice and like I said, they are affordable. All three of them, it was $32.00. Okay, so we're going back to the gold, diamond, and magic. Come on. Thank you. Down. Hmm. And like these are so pretty. I love glitter, I love glitter everything. Like, look at these. You guys see that? Like, yes. Okay, the first one is gold. Second one is diamond. Oh, the diamond's gorgeous. And the third is magic. Very pretty. 
Okay, so that is um, the Tasting Up Beauty Glazed Palette. Let me just try to wipe all this off. Oh, it's just making it worse, you guys. <laughs> making it worse. Okay, so this is palette B right here. Palette B. And then palette A that I already swatched right here. Very, very pretty. Okay, and then we are on the last palette from Beauty Glaze. Um, and this one is Dreaming Up. And this is palette number C. I love that. It looks so pretty. And the side of this one is um, like an orangey. Mm. This one has a few little breakage. Not much. And this one has more mattes in it. And just a few little shimmers but there are mattes in it like this one right here that one did break a little just a little just a little nug out of it but what you'd expect just to be in that envelope and you know some of the post office offices whatever you call them ladies men whatever some of them's careless with y'all fucking packages like i'm just saying it right there some of y'all are careless and some of them are really good so it doesn't really matter so this is draining up y'all can see there's a few shimmers but there are more mattes in this palette than shimmers so I am going to end this one and I'm going to start my other one and then I'm just going to um, add both of them into one. Okay, y'all. So I'll see you in a few seconds. Okay, y'all. I'm back. So back on palette C, Dreaming Up. I think I showed before. The colors are very, very pretty. I love the packagings. And we are going to go ahead and start swatching them. Going from left to right. Okay, so this one, I definitely see a lot of um, repeat names. But they are not the same in the other palettes. Nope, not in this one. And this one. Okay, so like, there's a hazelnut in the first one. This one is hazelnut right here. And then this one is called orange right here. And then, where else? not any in that one they're all done in that one and like nope it was just them ones and then if you look up here this one right here that one's called orange and then this one right here is called orange so, is what it is. It's okay with me. So, the first one is yellow. The second is orange. And then the third's um, Crimus. And the fourth is purple. Which this palette looks fun. This white color right here is super silky.
Okay, so palette C, this one, a lot of them are more buttery feeling than palette B, but palette B was very, very gorgeous as well. Like that white is bright as hell. I can sit there and use it as a highlight. Yep, I can. No makeup on my face, so I'm just. But yeah, that can definitely work as a highlighter. That's pretty. It's a little wonky, but it's pretty. Very pretty. Okay, so we are going on to the other orange, green, jungle, pink are our next four we are swatching. This orange is very, very pretty. And I have to really dig into this one. Um, these are powder-based eyeshadows. But they are very pretty. So I'm not, like I said, I ain't complaining. The pigment tints there. Um, once you use a primer, you can see if it blends right. But. So far, I'm enjoying these colors. These colors are coming out nice. My swatches ain't the best, but that's what it is. I'm not no, you know, big YouTuber. I So it doesn't matter. My swatches don't need to be perfect. <laughs> okay, so we are going on to violet, brick, red, olive, and lime. Some of these are creamy and some of them are um, a really hard, hard pressed powder. Um, and then, like, the shimmers. The shimmers are very, very um, silky and buttery and creamy. Same with the, um, the glitters, pressed glitter. These two greens are pretty. Same with this um, brick red. Oh, that green's pretty. Very pretty. Um, snatched these up, and when I went back to look at them, they are low in stock. So if you guys are interested in any of these palettes, if you're digging the colors, um, liking the palettes, I suggest you to go over there and snatch them before they go out because they were low on stock. But I'm not saying they won't restock because they probably will, but they are a little low. Not too much, but it's what it is. Okay. So on to the Lily Coral. Um, maroon and sand. Oh, that purple is going to be beautiful. I love using bright, bright colors on my eyes and everything with glitter. Um, I usually use like the nudes and stuff if I don't want to wear too much makeup for the day. But that purple is gorgeous and so is that pink. I love pink. 
and that's like a Barbie pink right there and that purple is gorgeous and that's a basic nude that green's really pretty like I said green yellows and orange and whites even blacks they're really the hardest to find with pigment but so far these ones are looking good <sighs> okay so the next is brick clay hazelnuts and honey which this brick is like this yellowish color which a lot of the names in here are super super interesting because they don't match up with the colors um, but it is very cool Okay, so that's what these look like. And the yellows in this palette are very nice. So that honey color right here is gorgeous. Like you can build this up two times or if I wear that highlight and stuff as a primer on my eye, that will pop. Because I do that to a few of my yellow eyeshadows and my greens. Okay, so on to Gold Earth, um, Merlot, and Dark. Gold and Earth are a shimmery color and Merlot and dark are a matte. All neutral colors right there. The shimmers got me. These two shimmers. Shimmers in them colors are always my favorite. For, you know a basic nude look I always have to rock either them two type of colors always <laughs> okay so the last one is peril and this is a blackish right here looks pretty dark It is pretty dark. Let me go over it twice to see how it would look if you do it two times. Yeah, it's a really good dark right there. Really good black. Okay, so that is all three of the Beauty Glazed um, palettes. Um, I am very impressed with them. I really, really do enjoy them. They are, some of them's a little chalky, some of them's not, um, but these will be very, very fun to work with. This is palette C. Can you all see them? Palette C. This one got the orange there. And this is palette A. This has that beautiful purple. And then palette B, which is a green. And then it has like that ocean, ocean green right here. Okay, so um, my favorite would definitely be this one right here. Because this blue... This one and this sunset is just gorgeous. Um, I love this one is absolutely my favorite. My second favorite will be palette C. And then my third will be palette B. But they are all very, very pretty. This is B again. Let y'all look at it. Very pretty colors. I guess it all depends on yourself on which type of colors you like but I am into all this 
This is C again, just showing you one more time. I'm probably going to wipe it down some because there are powder everywhere. And then palette A. One more time. Very pretty. Okay, y'all. So that is my swatches from Beauty Glazed. Um, let me know down below in the comments if you tried these palettes or if you tried anything from Beauty Glazed. Um, I have not. Um, so I was pretty excited to come across them and everything. So like I said, they, I had them up in my shopping cart for a really long time debating if I want to get them or if I don't want to get them. Like arguing inside my head. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to get them. They can be a hit. They can be a mist. Um, and so far, um, like I said, palette A is my favorite. I give this one a 9 out of 10 because I do have to see how it performs on the eye. Um, palette B, I do really enjoy the colors on this one, but I am going to give this one an 8. Um, but... We'll try it out on the, on the eye. That all came out wrong on the eye. And go from there. Palette C, I am going to give this one a 9 as well. Um, they were very nice. They are super powdery. But that's okay. Um, they were super silky. Certain ones. But overall... Worth the price, $32 for three palettes with 24, no, 25 shadows in it. Decent size. Um, the packaging's cute. Um, no mirror, but the packaging's cute. The colors really did have, um, some of them were really pigmented. Some of them were pigmented, but if you, uh, you know, worked up on it or had a really good eye primer or used a white base it would make them pop even more but i'm going to have so much fun messing around with these ones just like my other ones that i got from dd's Dee discount um i'll link that video down below um and like i said i have more haul is coming with more makeup palettes so there will be more swatches to show you guys um but yeah I am going to end this video so I can go spend some time with the fiance and everything and I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I hope you guys enjoyed your weekend hope you guys are staying safe hope you, uh, hope you guys are staying blessed um, also another reminder, um, I'm going to repeat, um, the questions for the giveaway. I am probably going to do it either, either on the 30th or the 31st of this month. So stay tuned for that video. If I run a little late, it will probably be May 1st, um, because we are trying to, like I said, trying to get everything up and going and safe outside when my nieces and nephew come up in May no in June after they get out of school because they went back to school um, they were doing it virtual online and stuff but they did go back to school as of this month to try to get things going but yes um, it would be either April 30th April 31st or May 1st. So stay tuned for the drawings of the names. Like I said, I'm writing everyone's name that's already participates in the giveaway in this beautiful cup right here. And every single time someone comments down the questions for the giveaway, their name goes right into that cup. So the questions are your favorite movie, your favorite color, your favorite holiday. Um, like I said, I am going to get off of here 
and I hope you guys, you know, believe in yourself, stay humble, stay blessed, stay fabulous, stay beautiful because every single one of you guys are beautiful no matter what you think about yourself, no matter what anyone else thinks about yourself. You look in that mirror and you tell yourself you are beautiful, strong, independent, and you can do anything you put your mind to. Okay, y'all, I'm going to jump off of here. Um, like I said, I hope you have a wonderful week and I will be back here shortly with some more hauls and some more swatches. Um, bye, y'all.